All right, so let's start the farmhouse tour. Here we are, a million stars floating over our heads. Your fruit uh, bearing trees area. Falling apart, staying up to forget. Perfectly plucked. Good day everyone, happy new year everyone. Today we're here in Alfonso Cavite to feature a 1.3 hectares overlooking farmhouse for sale with riparian rights. Before we start our farmhouse tour, I invite you all to hit that subscribe button and click that bell to get you notified for whenever we release new YouTube videos. We're on Facebook, Instagram, Viber, WhatsApp, email, email by simply clicking the link below on the description box. You can also search us via Google at www.reemilyada.com. Now let's start the farmhouse tour. Let's take it slow. Where you go, I go to. And if you hit the bottom, I'm going down with you. Alright, so before we begin our farmhouse for sale today, thank you so much to the seller, to our liaison, Mam Clarice, no, for sending us a massive overlooking. It's a Torrance property for sale in the market. Anyway, this one has a total land area of 1.3 hectares, improvement around 500 to 600 square meters. So you have the main house, you have the party area, you have a spacious, wherein, a spacious area wherein you can land your helicopter. It's a overlooking, it's a fresh property for me because it has that riparian rights, meaning you have a stream at the back of the property, which later on or in a bit, we will check that out. And then the first thing is the physical appearance of the property. Right now, this is the frontage area. Then as you can see, you have a two-lane road. It's cemented, meaning it's accessible property. And then you have nice frontage around uh, 50 meters frontage. Again, it's a 1.3 or 13,000 square meters land size. All right, so right here, you have nice gates. Agriba Benji? Yes. Yeah, okay. The first thing is, the appearance outside of the property the gate okay so you have nice uh, services gate over here and then the pedestrian gate right there all right so which way first here or dito sa likod ko you walk <laughs> all right now before we uh, go inside the property no thank you so much sa lahat po ng bumili ng property no dito sa amin no, thank you so much and then uh, okay, Mr. Tan, okay, Mr. Singh, okay, okay, Mr. K, all right. And then okay, Mom Sarah, and then etc. Marami pa po kayong iba. And the same time, no, thank you so much again sa ating clients from the Europe, America, and then also from the New Zealand and Australia. The same thing, dito sa Philippines, napakadami nating clients. Okay, so kung nag enjoy kayo ngayon sa ating farmhouse tour, give us a like, comment, share, and click that subscribe button. Tama ba, Benji? Yes! Okay, so to, over to my right side, plotted fruit bearing trees. As you can see, you have plenty of coconut tree. Okay, agree? Agree! The same thing, ang lapit natin sa stratosphere. Okay? Yeah. Okay, you have a driveway over here. Let's go. To my left side, okay, na plenty of fruit bearing trees. It seems like the lanzones, etc. So if you're interested, or anyone interested to buy and check out this one guys contact us today on the numbers visible on the screen okay let's go all right and napakaganda diba so pwede siyang i-develop as a uh, events place a uh, wedding venue or a uh, retreat house but for me nice place as your retirement home perfectly uh, designed yung bahay nila and then you have the ilog doon sa likod uh, which later on no pupuntahan natin anyway right here although no it's uh, 13,000 square meters of land it's well maintained nakikita mo naman no napakaganda ng landscape and then uh naka-plot naka-arrange hindi makalat diba Benji yes then uh, the same way it's full defense okay let's go Anyway, for, for my evaluation, it's a virgin forest, right? Yes. Virgin farmhouse, no? Virgin farmhouse meaning, uh, hindi pa daw natatouch. Hindi pa tama ba, Sami? Hindi pa natatouch pag virgin farmhouse? I think so. <laughs> yes. Okay. 
Okay, over there you have a big mango tree and then a covered parking area and then sometime ginagawa nila as a music room pero meron silang a uh, proper music room and then the guest room okay right here let's go all right i love the contour of the property because it's a slope and then with a flat land and then right here you have the sitting space you have the shower area and then toilets the same way you have a trellis design right here and a bonfire over there okay your property is Anga naka fence. Now let's check out the house. Now, so this is the dwelling area. So it's it has a floor area or improvement around 600 plus square meters, eight rooms. So uh, two story with a modern architectural design. Okay, let's go. So you have steps here. Then I love the railings because they're stainless. And then you have a pocket garden which is here it's a uh, overhung no it's a floating pa pocket garden so maganda dito maglagay ng greens and some plants all right and then over here okay so you have a uh, balcony space so you have the access in here so this is the main entrance and then right here you have a front balcony and then you have a sitting space so i love the design of the whole uh, structure because it's modern now let's go inside and check out your new dwelling area here in alfonso cavite okay let's go commando So welcome to your new home here in Alfonso Cavite. So mind you, the property location from here to Tagaytay area around a 15 minutes drive away. So depends on your drive. So as you can see, via drone, ang ganda ng area kasi it's small valley pero it's overlooking property. And then I love the structure design because it's uh, almost new property. Okay, the first feature which is here, your living space. As you can see. You have the sitting space over here and then big picture window of course it's a high ceiling beautiful ceiling design plus you have the chandelier above mind you that this property is selling fully furnished so anything you see away from their personal items personal belongings stays in the house so the sofa stays in the house and then you have a dining area right there which is over here so i love the partitions in here so it's a tubular design it's a tubular of course, uh, there is separation from the living area to the dining space. But it's movable, right? Yes. So if you wanted to uh, move it up para medyo bigger later on, so it can be movable. But for me, it's a nice uh, design of the house with uh, partitions. Okay? Then here, wow! Ito yung pinakamagandang area kasi it's uh, overlooking which is right over there. This is your formal kitchen space. Dito sa harapan ko, you have a 8 seaters dining table. So luckily, this furniture stays in the house. So nice area we're in. Pwede mag-chill. Now, right here, you have the bar area. Okay, so you have seating space which stays in the house. Then you have a bar counter. Of course, you have a wine storage space which is dito sa pinaka focal of this bar area and then right there you have is door which leads you to the office and then an additional door right here leads you to the prayer room so napakaganda ng bahay no kasi it's complete so meaning you have a bedroom for the human being and then you have a room for the spiritual being right so they are christian and then they believe na pag mayroon silang prayer room, mas kasama nila lagi ang sa Holy Spirit. Okay? 
which is nice, ba? So uh, have you read the book of Cornelio in the in the Acts? Cornelio. Okay, just check that out. And then in here you have nice uh, kitchen space. You have L-shaped counter with sink, of course, beautiful box plus finish, and then overhead storage. Then you have rinse in cooking space. So this is your uh, formal kitchen, and then right there, don't sa likod, you have a dirty kitchen which is in a bit. Now we will check out the bedroom. Okay, so we'll check out first the master bedroom which is to my right side. Okay, I love the door, jam door jams as well. It's a wood, wood. and then uh, spacious and wide door. It's a solid wood. Okay, let's go inside. So this is the master bedroom area. Now, so upon entering, so it's a spacious area, right? Yeah. So you have a TV over here, and then the console table, plus you have a bed in here, which is a stays in the house. So you have, it's a queen size bed or a king size bed. I think it's a king size bed. So you have nice design over here with big windows. Plus it's a high ceiling kasi matangkad yung may ari nito. So yeah, very airy, very comfortable. And then it's a beautiful property for me, okay? Beautiful ceiling design. And then since it's the master bedroom area, you have a balcony which is here. Okay. Fronting dito sa inyong pinaka backyard. This is your backyard with the access dito sa riparian rights. Riparian rights meaning you have the access dito sa stream or the lakes and then the rivers which pupuntahan natin no? para makita nyo na may river talaga dito. Okay, so since it's a 30, uh, 13,000 square meters in land size, so you have a space where you can, land, you can put a helipad area, right? I think right there is a nice spot for the helipad. Okay, calling sa lahat ating mga clients na looking for a big size property and then pwede pang magland yung helicopter hi ma'am Jasmine I think this one perfectly para sa so para naman kay sir ang hi mr ang I think this one also is perfect for you so if you're interested or anyone interested no you can contact us today on the numbers visible on the screen so it's our hot say no mostly sa mga farmhouses with a big size land now you have the air conditioning unit of course since this is a master bedroom area right here you have a bathroom area wow look at the closet space wow massive closet space so you have plenty of storage spaces over here and then over to my right side you have a bathroom with the urinal area which is here Okay, excuse me, na. I think uh, the seller will do the river best before the turnover of the property. So you have the sink, you have the uh, water closet with bidet, of course, you have the urinal area and the shower space with, I think, water heater. Okay. So you have a sliding door over here. It is a special feature of the house. Remember the story of Cornelio. So there is a prayer room sa bahay. So which is here. Check this one. Yeah. Right. So you have the prayer area. Meron kang altar area over here. Okay. And then adjacent, you have the office over here. I'll oh, check this one. So you have the office. So it's a perfect home. No? Diba Benji? Yes. So if you like this video, guys, you can also share our videos in your mga relatives, friends, kakilala ka mag anak, kkk, diba? Right, sharing is caring, right? Yes. Okay, now let's check out the heart of the home, which is the kitchen space, the staff room area. Of course, you have the bathroom, mm. and then the powder room over here. Wait, okay, you know, before we mess, itong isang side na to. So you have a bedroom again, no, adjacent uh, dito sa master bedroom area. Okay, check this one. Wow, wow, I love the placement of the bedroom because you have in fantastic view of the backyard and then the greens and then in here you have a queen size bed you have balcony space of course you have air conditioning unit okay plenty of storage spaces here and then the vanity counter plus you have a wash area and a shower space this is the bathroom area and then I love the bathroom tiles 
Di ba? Pasok ka. Tingnan mo. Look. And then the shower enclosure. Perfectly designed. Now, let's check out the, the everyday kitchen. So, since I love to eat, no? Sila din. Mahilig silang kumain. Now, in the event, you have guests. So, right here, you have the powder room, which is here. Alright, so you have a wash area and a water closet with bidet with uh, awning window. Okay, so you have a powder room. And then, pabuntas sa living area. And then, in here, steps. Dito sa inyong pinaka everyday kitchen. So, in here, you have the double door refrigerator. And then... A shower room and then the bathroom space. Okay, water closet. Yan, completo. Yan, look at that. So, mayroon silang uh, bathroom dito kasi you have staff room adjacent, which is right there. Okay, over here you have a staff room. Napakaganda ng hangin dito. Very fresco. Oh, excuse mo lang muna sa magamit ha. Okay. Uh, look at that. So, nice views of the greens at ang lapit mo rin sa clouds. Okay? So, you have bench in here and then your dining area. Of course, right here you have the pantry area. Okay, pantry area. Yeah, so this is the pantry area. Okay. And then, alright. So, ito yung pinaka kitchen space. And then in here, your prep area, additional kitchen area. Your dirty kitchen, which is right over here. Alright, so, Pasko pa ngayon dito, guys. Na? So, naghahanda sila pakain sa amin. Now, tingnan natin yung room, the guest room, the music area, downstairs or the basement area. So, you have access from here, so dirty kitchen. Then you have access also from the main entrance, direct to the guest room, and then the music area. Don't sa likod. Okay? Let's go, Commando. Down with you, let's take it slow. Who cares where we gotta be? You know you'll have a good time wherever you are. Alright, so we're here, dito sa pinaka facade of the property. Okay, so as you can see, the facade of the house, entry kit, plus, it's a nicely designed, okay, it's modern, okay, so right here, you have a side yard wherein you can uh, put some greens, plants, etc. And right now, I'm some greens, and then you have the pathways over here, and it's the fence. So for me, maganda dito maglagay ng swimming pool. So since meron kang source of the water doon sa pinaka streamline or doon sa pinaka ilog, so you have a source of the water. Okay? Huh. Right. Okay, over here, this is the guest room. This is the guest room area. So you have two access. So one dito sa side na to, and then the other one from the other side then the storage area okay check this one let's go inside wow see it seems like meron kang dalawang bahay o meron kang uh, dalawang area we're in uh, the family area and then the guest area so dito sa ilalim na to, you have a complete features again so from the kitchen, so we'll check out the kitchen, which is here. Okay, seating space, seating area stays in the house. Of course, nice ceiling design. And then I love the wall. Very happy and very lively. Okay, then the wall design. So you have the switches and outlets. And then in here, you have the eight-seaters dining table. You have the uh, island counter in here. Plus, you have storage spaces and the straight counter, of course, storage spaces. Then over here, you have a bathroom. Bathroom area. Okay, with sink and a wash water closet with bidet. Now check this one. Okay, okay, let's go. Okay, refrigerator stays in the house. Okay, so you have the sitting space and then the bedroom music area and then the shower area. Now over here, 
So you have bed and then you have air conditioning unit. Ba? Perfect. Perfect, Benji? Yes! And then in here, additional room with storage space, storage and then air conditioning in it. Okay, nice uh, overhead designs. And then across you have two shower area. So you have shower space here. Okay, shower area. And then the shower area again, plus the restroom. Okay, this is the restroom area. Good day. And then you have a counter and sink in here. We're not done yet because we'll check out the music area right over here. Okay, so you have a cute family area in here. Plus, right here again, you have a bedroom. Big bedroom with a bathroom. Right, so you have a bed, an additional bed, of course, with air conditioning unit, with a shower space and bango. I guess. So, ito yung uh, hideout mo dito sa Alphonse sa Cavite ngayon. So, kompleto, no? You have a water, okay, with shower, and then water closet with wash area. Okay. So, maraming surprises itong house na to. Kasi right here, you have a music area. Wow! Maganda, di ba? So, mayroon ka mga sound bars. And then, big smart TV over here. Of course, additional space again. So it's a perfectly designed property for me. Plus the location itself. Plus the features within the property. Then the inclusions in all real estates. Real estate improvement or anything attached to the land. Now, we're done dito sa inyong pinaka bahay. Then we'll check out the backyard and then the the riparian rights okay so let's go benji let's take it slow. all right all right so this is the back view of the property as you can see via drone and laki ng property natin imagine itong house na to, improvement around 600 plus square meters now it's a slope and then, uh, titignan natin the ilog area. Okay, let's go. Okay, so, dito sa side na to, you have the enclosed, no? Greenhouse area. Then you have steps here. Okay. Papunta dito sa inyong ilog. Okay, let's go. So, in terms of fruit trees, so, sobrang dami, no? In terms of herbs, marami din dyan. And then, uh, okay. Merong uh, agaw attention sa akin. So, nakakain na ba kayo ng marang? Yeah, meron silang marang, oh. Sarap yan. Parang ikaw nanonood ngayon, para kang masarap. Hindi, huwag na yan. Okay, let's go. Over here. You've been lost and alone in the city. Right, uh, okay guys, so ito yung pinaka-end ng property. As you can see, it's a slope. And then, uh, doon sa ilalim, you have a ilog area na wherein pwede kang maglagay ng swimming pool or i-convert yung property nito as uh, income generating later on uh, once you are in the possession of the property. Alright, so again, it has a total land area of 13,000 square meters. So if you are interested or anyone interested, guys, contact us today. But before we end our farmhouse tour, so let's do the recap. Right, so before we mess, meron pang structure dito, guys. Okay, so you have the wash area, bedroom, and a bathroom. Okay. So you have the uh, staff room, 
driver room and then we have a uh, powder room and then additional driver's area okay so your chill out area here okay okay so you have storage space here okay the dirty kitchen your uh, dapug area so i love the dapug okay you have the dapug over here hmm. then wash area again and then uh, right here okay so you have the shower area and then the in the event mabalang kanin ng kuryente so you have the back up over here which is which is your generator area and then your water tank overhead and the greenhouse space okay all right so you have a space here it's covered with swing yeah and we're in you can relax play and sleep over here and then wow then enjoying your uh, front yard okay so you have plenty of fruit trees and then etc okay plus additional swing in here oh, tignan natin kung gumagana ba to right okay kulay green the pure gold right yeah pure gold okay thank you so much we're taking on water yeah we're sinking now you're looking all concerned like we're gonna drown But we both know how to swim No worries, let's go for now Let's take it slow Where you go, I go too Alright, so before we end our farmhouse tour Dito sa Alfonso Cavite Thank you so much to our liaisons To our agents for always sending us A vast property as always And then uh, it's a Torrance property so again, it's it has a total land area of 13,000 square meters, improvement 700 square meters. It's enclosed with fence, 50 meters frontage. So you have a main house with eight rooms, and then plenty of bathroom, and then with a greenhouse, and then with the riparian rights, with the easement actually done silicon. So if you are interested or anyone interested to buy and check out this property, contact us today on the number is visible on the screen. But before we end, no shout out sa ating mga buyers na bumili sa atin ng property now from the New Europe country, sa Australia, sa New Zealand, sa Philippines as well. And of course, from North and South America. Thank you so much. Tagang salamat. Gracias amigo, amigo all over the globe. Thank you very much and God bless everybody. Take it slow, who cares where we gotta be, you know you'll have a good time wherever you're with.